Are you looking for a handheld video gaming console? You can check out the Ionio Flip DS Gaming handheld console. It's actually a video gaming console, as you can see on screen. Now, it's in pre-order stage from Indiegogo, and the pre-order price is actually seven hundred and two dollars which would be twenty two percent off the retail price if you don't pre-order it and you wait until it is after the pre-order you'll have to pay nine hundred and three dollars it does ship worldwide if I scroll down a little bit you'll see that it does ship worldwide this is from Shenhan China I believe Shenzhen, sorry, Shenzhen, China. Okay, but they do ship worldwide. This is Ionio.com, Uniform Research Locator is on screen highlighted. It's a, it does have Microsoft Windows 11 Home Edition. It's dual screen, it's flip. It's a handheld two joysticks. Windows handheld standard gaming controller, two of them. And here's some more images. Optical finger mouse, IE uh, Space 2.0. Oculink interface for a graphics card expansion. Hall sensing joystick plus Hall trigger. 28 watt plus air cooling system a standard gaming controller layout now what is this automatic lock at 100 degrees 150 degrees or 180 degrees it does have a flip screen it has a 7 inch 120 Hertz which is the refresh rate that's not bad it does support 1080p which is 1920 pixel by 1080 pixel resolution a dynamic screen the number seven dual screens featuring a 3.5 inch 960 pixel by 640 pixel resolution touchscreen I'm not sure if it's a light emitting diodes or a liquid crystal display I'm assuming it's a light emitting diode screen three by two screen aspect ratio per retro gaming this is the feature modules this is our software performance settings quick settings quick application smart secondary screen it does have Microsoft Windows operating system it has the native extended screen for enhanced gameplay oh it has two screens it has one to you know as your monitor so to speak and also it looks like here there's one embedded into it looks like it has two screens yes it does yep dual screens this large screen is seven inch what was that I think three and a half inches for the smaller screen anyway let's move along you can play retro games dual screen what anything any other multitasking support oh it says you can play games on the main screen while checking walkthroughs on the secondary screen yep okay so as you can see it actually has a file explorer it does right here it's it has Microsoft Windows 11 home edition so it actually has a real live operating system that's not you know a gaming operating system more images you can install a third-party dual screen management software comes with dual screen keys for management single click double click long press more images controller first layout it has joystick d-pad and a b x y buttons two joysticks and I think they're the are they the same yeah I think they are the the dual joysticks are the same 
Okay. Oh, and do the books come with it? And the coffee cup and saucer? Yeah, I'm not sure. You know? Hey, hey, you never know nowadays. You know what I'm saying? Okay. It the screen will lay flat too. Now I'm not sure if the it looks like the no are the joysticks no they're not exactly in the same place so one's higher than the other one anyways a flip cover a magnetic design we already went over the three preset that automatically locks and there are some specifications Ho hopefully I will yeah this is all redundant now so I should get there 314 pixels per inch 400 nits brightness 120 percent what is that RGB for red green blue and also 100 percent uh, gamut coverage for red green blue 1200 by one contrast ratio yeah, there's a disclaimer there I think it only comes in two colors it looks like milky white and shadow black the black and white white and black duality There are screws hidden beneath the grips. Okay. Ultraviolet. Oh, combined with PC plus fiberglass material. Okay. About a minute and a half. Yeah. Oh, gaming cartridges. Do they come with them too? Okay. Comfortable ergonomics. 180 by 120, 102 millimeters. Okay, uh, doke. Replaceable grip design. Uh, More images, lots of images. Eighty-six twelve interface, PCI Express port by four direct connection, effective bandwidth up to sixty-four gigabits per second. Oh, it, do, it does have those cards. Yeah. Okay. Or little cartridges or whatever you want to call them. Full featured universal serial bus port interface. Mm, 7.8 gigabits bandwidth. The OcuLink. This is redundant. Heat dissipation, so it has fins on it, and the TF card slot voids the air. Eight minute mark. I'm getting. Come on. There's a lot of images here. So it comes with advanced micro devices processors, the Zen 4 CPU, 4 nm manufacturer process. Maximum clock frequency is 5.1. Eight large cores, 16 threads. Advanced micro device radio on 780m. Graphics processor unit, RDNA3 architecture, core frequency 2.7 GHz, AMD Ryzen artificial intelligence engine, NPU computing, power 16 tops, 88400U, OU is the AMD Ryzen microprocessor, 64 gigabyte LPDDR dynamic dual register, blah, 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 memory, M2 2230 PPI Express for solid state drive. And I'm not sure if it's upgradable. The default memory frequency is set to 64 megahertz at the back. That's the speed. I'm not sure what the memory is, the speed. Did they mention it? It says it's set at the factory. I'm not sure if you can adjust that. Uh, larger battery, 45 watts, more images. Yep, reds and circuses, I mean. Does the books come with it? The copy table? Do the, and oh, Yeah, it does have little cartridges. Okay. Oh, no drift, high precision joysticks, trigger sensitivity, joystick sensitivity, motor vibration, zero power consumption standpoint, gyroscope, yeah, I already went over the key type, button, rapid fire function, and hall sensing joystick, hall trigger, Mattel dome buttons, we went over that already. Okay, come on, come on. Uh, there's more images. Muy, muy rápido. Let's move along from this. Okay, this is redundant right here. So push up to two terabytes. The type of storage. Uh, 
this is redundant too. Those are the, the, the type of cartridges. And the uh, Universal Serial Bus 4 Type-C interface, up to 40 gigabits per second speed. That's pretty good. It supports 4K video at 144 frames per second refresh rate. It has, looks like, one Universal Serial Bus 3.2 Generation 2 Type-C data interface, up to 10 gigabits per second speed. A TFA card slot, up to 300 megabits per second read speed. Oh, wow. It comes with a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. I'm not sure if that's duplex. I'm not sure if you could hook up an external microphone and use it as a microphone. Get it out to put input into the output. Couldn't tell you that. Power button, okay, sports Wi-Fi E6E, and Bluetooth 5.2. Oh, it just goes on and on. Microsoft Windows, it's actually, it has Microsoft Windows 6, oh, Home Edition 64, that, that's redundant. Oh, 7 inch, this is redundant. Main screen specifications, we went over, I think, all this already. Uh, CPU, went, went over that. Secondary screen specifications, yeah, I went over that already. Storage, 16 gigabyte. I'm assuming random access memory plus the 512 gigabyte storage. Well, they have different models. 32 gigabyte up to 2 terabyte storage. 64 gigabyte of memory up to 2 terabyte of storage. The the memory type is on screen. That's redundant. The solid state drive, that's all redundant. Cooling, all new large area. Yeah, that's redundant. We're on over that 28 watt. That's redundant. Redundant. Oh, redundant. Redundant redone it this is all redone it we already went over the connection types that's all redone it mm, how about the weight 650 gram size 180 well, that's redone it too this is all redone it yep software management that's redone it too that is this video pertaining to the Ionio as I distract myself looking at the images, the Ionio Flip DS Gaming Handheld Council. Adios!